Hello everyone, Michael Strauch here, Computer MD of Gilbert, and today I'm going to teach you how to download safely, because I know I told you in the last video on how to get rid of ads on Google Chrome that you needed to know how to download safely, because a lot of times the ads that you get will come from downloading, um, well, not following the right download precautions. So I'm just going to take this uh, random download any video converter, it is safe, I used it before, but I'm going to show you how to download it correctly. So first you click download. When you do that, it's going to start downloading here, right here. And you don't have to worry about any of this. Um, you just worry about your download here on Chrome. Um, just going to let it download for a second. And then I'm going to show you how you start to install it. Okay? Because these parts coming up. Alright, so now watch. I click on it. Do I want to run this file? Yes, I want to run it. It's it's all good from there. Yes, I want to run it. English. Okay, but now, now you have to watch what's going on here in the setup wizard, okay? So I'm going to click next. You make sure you read everything, okay? So now this agreement, usually this first agreement, I accept. No problems, okay? But, I click next. This is all good. This is the f folder it's going to. Good. Okay, you wanted to create a desktop icon, okay. Here's the part that you need to learn. Any video can... Any video confer converter recommends the AVG toolbar to improve your internet protection. Now, this is incorrect. They're trying to do this because sometimes they'll affiliate with uh, these other companies and try to sell their products on there or just put them on there so that they get their name out. You want to, it, and they do this on purpose, you do see another bubble here, but you see very lightly, if you can even see it, I don't know, it says custom installation. You want to click that bubble. And this is, it's all different for all different ones. This is just this specific one. But what I'm telling you is, you need to look for, um, when it tells you to download the toolbar with it, you don't want to. You always want to look for the other alternative because it is there. Okay, so now I don't want that, and I don't want that. What I do is I click next. Now they're all unchecked, so the toolbar won't download. Now I'm not going to install it because I have it already on another computer. But from there, all you do is un install. Once you don't have, once you uncheck your toolbar or whatever they're trying to sell you and put on your computer, you want to uncheck it, and then from there you click install, and it installs, and it will create a desktop icon. And it's it's that easy to download the only thing is you just have to make sure when they're trying to get you to get something like a toolbar or something of that nature that you look for the alternative because there is one that allows you to uncheck a box or check custom uh, custom download or custom installation because you do not want to have those toolbars or whatever they want to try to put on your computer you do not want that so then once you uncheck it, you're good to go. Um, and then I, as always, like I always say, I would run a super anti-spyware um, run after that. Uh, of course, I have my videos about that too on my channel here. So that's it's as easy as that. You just got to make sure you uncheck whatever they're trying to give to you, whether it be the toolbar, which is the most popular. Um, but that's how you do it and then you install from there and you're good to go but like I said run super anti spyware after it now uh, okay whoops I wanna exit now if you're looking for a safe place to download I recommend CNET or it's also download.com they're the same thing if you didn't know that uh, so in the search bar you should type in download.com and it'll take you to the downloads and that's one of this that's the safest place to download programs if you're going to and then right here in that search engine you just search for what you're looking for in the software that you have and it's that simple and it gives you lots and lots of programs so thank you very much and I hope you all know how to safely download now